Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Dark Side Detective Season 2. We can go upstairs or downstairs. I don't know of a way to interact with this grandfather clock right now. Uh, I guess I could poke it with the uh, torch. Nah, I'd make a pig's ear out of that. And I don't think the stanky herbs are going to do anything. Yeah. Uh, let's go upstairs. Got another portrait. We've got... Uh, Two bedrooms. This one we can go into. This one we can't. And a portrait. Great old Gugnet Dooley, inventor of a sleeping on the job. I've never been more sure that this is my family. Do you have a tray in your coat? A tray? Or a sledge or a toboggan? These stairs are too good not to, to not slide down in some form or another. I guess that's sledge, not sled. Whatever. Somebody else's room. Not a place for us. Oh, I can open the attic door as well. We've got a painting here. A painting of a handle. The paint is layered on so thick, you could almost use it. You know, if it wasn't a painting. Uh-huh. Got a candle. I like the carefree and liberal use of naked, unmonitored flame in this place. Really sets the atmosphere. Is there a woman's face screaming inside the knob of that locker drawer? Boy, is anyone who doesn't get that reference going to be lost. Got a bed. Half a four-poster bed. Fancy. No, half a four-poster bed. Fancy. Dooley, you know that's just perspective. Uh, no, wait, you're right. Two posters. I guess we're only half welcome. I, I, I don't actually get the, the locker thing. I call top bunk. Dooley, there's only one bunk. Well, looks like S Slowpoke McQueen has to sleep under the bed then. Can I look under the bed? No. Alright. Well, this is a letdown. Dooley, this is gorgeous. Sure, but I misread this room as en suite, and well... There's a vent here. A damp-looking vent. Setting up my new home, doody doo. Who's that? I don't know. Sure, you see shower heads everywhere, but have you seen a shower body? Not since the French shower revolution. <laughs> uh, detective, you might need to close this case yourself. I need to interrogate this bathtub. No, Dooley, it's still early in the case. If you get in there now, someone is going to stab you. Why even have a mirror if it's going to be tiny? I made all of mine to be seen. My heart sinks every time I enter a bathroom. What, what, what? Can McQueen not make those kinds of jokes, Dooley? Tiny plug. Look, we have a tiny bathroom plug. We have tiny bathroom plugs here, too. See, we're not so different after all, you and I. Huh? Okay, not seeing anything that I can interact with right here. And I did talk to you. Did I talk to you out here? Yes, I did. Alright, open attic door. Let's go into the attic. That is a gigantic dollhouse, and there's another ladder up. The doorway is blocked by these obnoxiously large toys. Is there anyone hiding in there? Stay away! Why don't you come out and tell us where the sunstone is? Never, literally never. I've never said... I've set up a home in here and I'm cultivating the fungus I can live off. You'll never get me out. Challenge accepted. To be clear, though, it was meant as a statement of demoralizing fact rather than an issuing of any challenge. Challenge accepted. There's a smaller castle in this giant castle. That is kind of it. That is the kind of extravagance, extravagance I get behind. Uh, vents, vents. Interesting. Uh huh. I have an idea. Hmm. Hatch at the top won't budge. Looks like a mechanism is locked in place. Okay. Well, bedroom, ensuite. 
That won't work. I need a way to get the smell of them to rise through the vent. I know I'm just a simple beat cop and not a fancy pants detective, but I think you just made a smelly plant smellier. You received item of burning herbs. This should smoke them out. <coughs> oh, that smell! Are you going to get out of here? Hmm, <laughs> pardon me. Looks like we smoked them out. Book them, Dooley. Yeah, book them, Dooley. No, wait, sorry. That's me. Book them, me. Coughing person. <laughs> and I just keep uh, hiccuping when I try to cough. Maybe water will help. Where's the sunstone? No idea. I got scared during the heist and hid in here. You'll get no info from me. I'll tell you that... And I'll tell you true. Barricade kicked over. I don't really st understand how these got knocked over, but I got the result I wanted, so happy days. This attic is the size of your apartment. It is, isn't it? Let's enter the dollhouse. Wind-up doll. That's kind of creepy. If you squint, you can almost, almost... It almost, almost looks like the American alphabet. Dooley. I guess this is a good place as any to store your noxious fog. A hurl? A hurl! They use these to play hurling. It's essentially a fight with sticks and an optional scoring system. Can we take it as a memento? Sure, I guess? A curved panel of wood. I think. I read about this. It's a hurl from the game Hurley. Two teams of 100 people beat one another with sticks while some of the less violent players score points. Fastest and most brutal game on Earth, apparently. It really is a stanky route. The stankiest. Part of the vent system that's allowed me to choke Louise out. Eh. A horrific wind-up toy with a wind-up key. Well, I'll take the key. Now it's a regular old toy with a hole in the back. Still horrific, though. Very much so. Maybe the worst thing we've seen all season. He has a glassy stare that says, kill me now. And me without a knife. Hawk. An old wind-up key. I didn't think that would work. Alright, there'll have to be something else that uh, opens that. Can we use the wind-up key on the painting? No, I'd make a pig's ear out of that. What about the uh, hurl? What if it isn't a painting? That's what I'm thinking. Let's go downstairs. Pat Dooley. There's a fridge. Let's talk to Dooley first. See, they have a kitchen here too, just like we have at home. A Dooley family tradition. This won't open. That's just for holding magnets. You know those wee magnets. People give them to you as souvenirs. Gosh, if only they had a handy name so I could explain them to you. Anyway, that's the magnet box. It doesn't open. Uh, we'll get some pots. Heads off pots, pets pots. What are these pots made of? Dreams. They're so shiny. There's a cupboard. What? This cupboard is actually filled with cups? Where's all the food? They say even a broken clock is right twice a day. I change its time strategically so this clock is never right. There's a bin. Ah, there are bits of a statue in here. That cooker is quite the beast. See, if we were in Holland, we could call it a Dutch oven. Stove top. Hands off, I'm boiling those kettles. For tea? What? No, to free the water soul. Look at it there, floating off to water heaven. Are you making fun of me? Honestly, I'm as unsure as you. Bye-bye, water ghosts!
There's a larder. Stairs to lobby. This house has a lobby. Let's all go to the lobby. Let's all go to the lobby. Oh, don't mind me. I got a wee wet, a bit wet in the rain, so I came indoors to warm my ferret. I don't see a ferret. It's a hungry wee monster, so it might be hunting for sausage around here somewhere. <laughs> uh huh. Have you seen any strange-looking individuals besides us? I did. Two men wearing one wearing a pervert coat and the other dressed as a, like a wee girl. Brilliant. Where did they go? They've intimidated her into silence. Don't worry, ma'am. We'll find them. I hate to say I didn't realize I was a woman. Is your name Pat, too? Family name. My siblings are Patty, Patsy, Patrice, and Patrullio. But no Patty. That makes no sense. None of us are slabs of meat. All right, goodbye. I better get going. Those Odulis aren't going to catch themselves. And they might. Not the brightest bunch. Right, into the larder. Glazed ham! Honey glazed ham. I think I've wet myself from saliva. I know! Me too. Salt and pepper. Push it. Push it real good. No, not the band. Bread loaves. Honey loaves. Mm. Is there anything they can't make out of honey? cooking lard. Given how old this place is, a lubricant seems like it could come in useful at some point. Sweet. A large blo block of lard. Used to fry absolutely everything over here, including life expectancy. Pot of stew. The remains of a stew made out of honeyed beef. How are there leftovers? That's a good question. A baguette? A baguette delivered this morning from France. One of the joys of being in Europe. And, you know, not the UK right now. A Druid's Delight Mead. I'm starting to think I've been drinking honey the wrong way. Don't you eat honey rather than drink it, even though it's semi-liquid? Normally? Not in mead form? Boxes? Boxes full of bees! That explains the honey to everything. Ham. Ham. <clears throat> uh, poster. Rub a puka on your Veruca. I don't know why he looks so happy about it. Poor wee guy. I love this thing. I used to ride it between here and wherever it goes. Dooley, for the last time, you haven't been here before, so you can't have used this dumb waiter. Hey, I'm neither dumb nor a waiter. Oops. I, I mean, whatever this uh, broken lift thing would say. Broken, eh? Yeah, that's why I'm only made to get away and not fully gotten away. One of the cogs is broken and now I'm stuck. I think if we find a cog, we can get this guy out and arrest him. Okay, I remember there being cogs around here somewhere. Probably. I think I saw some. Not here. Nope, nope, didn't mean to click that again. Don't know what we're going to do with in there. This was a wind-up key would open on the... Uh, nope. Can you use the wind-up key here? Let's see what's going on in here, then. Seems to have some extra cogs. I'll take those. There we go. The clock looks and sounds like it's working again. Why were there extra cogs? Some cogs from the grandfather clock. Grandfather cogs. Let's get this thing fixed. Yeah, and free the dumb waiter who got stuck inside. Hey! Of course. All right, so we've got a uh, mini game. Um, I 
Nothing is jumping out at me as the obvious solution here. We only have one small one. We've got two mediums and two large ones. Uh, and these are both small ones. Okay, that works. Got it. That's the system back up and running. Let's get this guy out and into cuffs. I'd complain about having to work on holiday, but I just enjoy putting people in cuffs so much. Where's the sunstone? Ah, I'll never tell you. Because I don't entirely know. Mao Duli had it and got and I got separated from her when the lift broke. But she's a sharp one. You won't catch her with her trousers around her ankles. Oh no. You'll never take me alive! But we just did. Oh, uh, then you won't catch me. You are caught. I won't go down without a fight. Eh. Uh, I think I've died and gone to heaven. I know. Glazed ham? I mean, honey loaves, lard, salt and pepper, baguette. I've never actually had mead myself. If the stew weren't leftovers, yum. Most of all, glazed ham. Okay. Uh... Where else? Where else can we go? Um, hmm. Can we use cooking lard on that? Nope. The hurl? Nope. Uh, okay, nope. He doesn't have anything to say. Like, I can't ask him for the key to the uh, other room. No, that doesn't work. I think we've done what we need to do in this room, so I don't think there's anything there, but... Uh What about the uh, cooking lard on the ladder up? Nope. Hmm. Definitely missing what I need to do next because, uh,. Can't do anything there. Can't go off the map here. Can we use the uh, Hurley with the chandelier? No. But I feel like we need to get into the dining room somehow. Oh, wait, wait, with the dumb waiter's uh, fix. Let's try taking that up. Yeah, dumb waiter. Let's see where this goes now that it's working. My bad. There's something about a broken statue down in the uh, um, uh, kitchen as well. It's just like that statue I saw in the bin. Hmm, I wonder if that means one of these is fake. I should look for a way to verify the statues. I'll even have to double-check the portraits we found to be sure. There's a dumbwaiter. Got some banners. Long, flowing green banners. They sure do like green in this country. 
Big Finn Dooley, who supposedly bait the salmon of knowledge. Surely that should be eight. Eight the salmon? Nah, he caught it and gave it a beating for not knowing to avoid his fishing line. He has large hands. All the better for beating fish with. Maybe we can rule him out by finding a matching statue. The statue has the clubbed hands of famous fish fighter, a Big Finn Dooley. It's a painting of this dining room, including a smaller painting of this room, which has the same and so on ad infinitum. And infinity is endless. You can't really add, a, add it to something. All right, well, uh, we have a puzzle to figure out with these figures here. So uh, let's go ahead and uh, do that next time. See you then, everyone.